Anak Sarawak disaran agar menggunakan peluang yang ditawarkan Kerajaan Sarawak dalam pelan pembangunan jangka panjangnya sebagai usaha mencapai status Sarawak Maju 2030. Timbalan Premier Datuk Seri Dr. Sim Kui Hian berkata ia selaras dengan langkah memajukan Sarawak dengan pemerkasaan modal insan yang kompetitif dan profesional. Same time, uh, uh, take great this opportunity to find out what is happening to Sarawak. Where are the opportunity as we move forward to 2030? You know, in 2030, because I always said in the past you may not have opportunity, but now we we uh, with the recent developments and, and with all these uh, uh, program that planned by Premier, there may be new opportunities. Mengambil kira kejayaan syarikat petroleum Sarawak Berhad Petros, Dr. Sim berkata ia merupakan salah satu peluang yang dirangka oleh kerajaan Sarawak. Meskipun masih baru, namun Petros berjaya merekodkan pendapatan yang tinggi kepada Sarawak menerusi industri minyak dan gas. Dengan pengurusan ekonomi serta kaedah penjanaan sumber kewangan, Sarawak dilihat sebagai penyumbang utama berkeluaran dalam negeri kasar KDNK Malaysia. Uh, one of the classical example is our metros. Yeah, our metros. We used to be uh, a lot of local Sarawak came uh, now coming back because uh, the metros. We used to have no metros, and now uh, we have metros, and we need all the expertise and all the help. And yet, as a Sarawak, we need you to continue to contribute and uh, to make Sarawak achieve what I call 2030, in which uh, uh, we are the prosperous Sarawak, the number one. Uh, GDP, the largest economy in the whole of Malaysia. I mean, even though they laugh at us in the jungle of Borneo, our jungle now has carbon tradings. You know, in the past, they laugh at us. And then, uh, uh, that's why we are going to be number one. In terms of... Sarawak pada masa sama katanya harus bangga dengan kemajuan yang telah dicapai sehingga kini.